Hey guys, what's up? My name is Jose. Today I'm unboxing the Bluefinger CM200 3 adjustable color backlit keyboard with a cool crack pattern design. Now it comes from China and which is a little bit unassuring because a lot of this is in Chinese or Korean. I can be wrong. Correct me in the comment section below. But there is a lot of things wrong with the box itself. Um, the stuff in the details in the back is in Chinese or Korean, which is unassuring. It doesn't have the Blue Finger logo either, which is another con to this. Now let's start opening the box slowly uh, to get that climax feel. Um, now inside the actual packaging is a really nice uh, gaming mouse pad which I will put away and I'll talk about that later but you see me put it away in a couple of seconds and you'll see the manual up ahead now the actual manual is a little bit confusing a lot of it is in Chinese or Korean uh, there's two panels on the front I didn't show you that shows you how to change the color of the backlit which is uh, FN with and pressing the SL button once or twice now inside the actual packaging here is a uh, plastic wrap with styrofoam endings to secure the device through the shipment and uh, processing service. Now let's start unwrapping this baby and uh, look at the actual design here. Uh, there's some pros and cons to this keyboard. The length of the wire is a uh, con. It's pretty short I would say. I was a little bit disappointed with that. But as well this keyboard is well made for it being uh, 40 bucks for a keyboard now I just feel around the keyboard it's a membrane keyboard it's not mechanical so if you want a mechanical keyboard then be sure to look on Amazon or anywhere that you're trying to look at a uh, gaming keyboard it's a cool design which I'll show you in a couple of seconds the crack design with the uh, with with plugged in with fully backlit stuff like that so let's roll ahead and get that b-roll footage now so you see the first shot of the boo of the, the blue backlit it looks pretty amazing and you see the gaming mouse pad in the background uh, there is some pros and cons to the backlit as well i was having issues with two buttons in particular that keyboard uh this keyboard itself is pretty amazing i'm still going to do a full review in two weeks i really wanted to use this keyboard and get my general sense of it but now you see the red led backlit it looks pretty amazing um not my favorite color so i mean if you enjoy red backlit keyboards and this is obviously nice the next mural shot that i have is the purple backlit now by far this is my favorite cover using uh this keyboard with the backlit it looks just amazing i can't believe that that color is in there i'm gonna start using that as much as i can and i have another b-roll footage of the blue backlit blacklit <laughs> blacklit backlight for it um sorry about that now this keyboard uh, is fairly nice, it's nicely built, I say that a lot in today's video, but it is, it is the truth. Now I want to talk about the actual game uh, gaming mouse pad it comes with. Now I'll show you my Steel Series mouse pad that I'm using currently. Uh, it's a lot bigger than that, uh, it's a huge mouse pad, it's thick, so I mean it's going to last you a long time. I'm actually going to start using it in script. The uh, Steel Series mouse pad. Now that mouse pad gets dirty a lot, so I'm gonna be testing that to see how fast it gets dirty, how long will it last, and how well is it made. So uh, this mouse pad is well worth it. So if you guys are looking at this package, um, be sure to get it. It's 40 bucks on Amazon. I'll have a couple Amazon listings in the description box below. But if you guys enjoyed this unboxing, be sure to slap a like and comment down below what you think about this keyboard and what you think about razor keyboards because i was looking at those keyboards and a lot of people told me you're just paying for the brand name and you're actually getting a fairly decent product uh, i have mixed feelings about razor but anyways i'm not going to be talking about that in today's video i'm going to end it here you guys know who i am my name's jose i'll talk to you guys in another video lates and i'm out